today we are at our quads and coffee event. This is our open house event where people come out, drink some coffee, and of course fly some quads. Today we're trying out all of our indoor flyers. We've got skylights, we've got the Vision 40, we've got the Bobito. We've got all sorts of fun things. People are flying around inside and having a great time. So that was just a completely new experience for me, and especially with a tiny whoop that performs a lot like a micro as opposed to, you know, like a real whoop. Really incredible experience. I'm Matt, I'm 13, and I ride dirt bikes and fly quads. I'm from Orlando, Florida. I rip. I want to do freestyle and cinema. Yes! The image quality is amazing. I can see everything. I can see the future. <laughs> And I love it. Thank you! Miracle! What's up, Miracle? Oh my god, phone set. Mike from GemFan and GemFan actually sponsored this event, uh, helping us put it together. We really appreciate it. And on top of everything else, we've got a goodie bag for everyone that's coming through. Pull some stuff from GemFan. Yeah. What do you want if you come to Quads and Coffee? Okay, so here you'll find more props. This is the bomb. Props and more props. Ooh, and don't forget the Ooh. stickers. Mm. Everyone wants the stickers. You just come for the stickers. And more skits. Rider Riot stickers, and this is a limited edition Rider Riot Rampage Moonlight prop. These are LED props. This is one of the coolest things we ever did with Gem Fan. Yeah. Limited edition. You get these props to actually light up. So if you fly in Civil Twilight, you can actually see your glowing props. They were amazing. And of course, the lanyard. Gotta have some necklaces in there. If you guys didn't make it to this Quas and Coffee, you better make it to the next one. Gem Fan don't only make the best props, but they make the best brand chicken and waffles out there. These waffles were bussin' bussin'. Thank you, Gem Fan. Woo! Ultra, ultra times 10 bussin'. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, man, we're gonna see if we can get in there and burn up a few packs. So you did this? <laughs> you sure you want to claim this? I'm asking you right now on the spot, are you sure you want to claim this soldering spot? That's an amazing job. Look at this, look at that. 16 years old. Yeah. That was amazing. <laughs> you shredded too hard. Shredded too hard the prototype, Drew. Oh no. No one else even got a chance to fly it. No one got oh, No, I was testing it out. I got a little too aggressive. That's me. Whoops. You're available by Rotor Right soon, though. Well, are we? I don't know. <laughs> Justin found these injection molded ducks that fit really well. We just flew it around. Flies great, but I'm not happy with it after no, one crash. We, yeah, I we mean, it was a hard crash, but. Something a little bit better for this, but this is definitely a prototype. The concept is super cool. Super cool. Ducted driblets definitely coming, but we're going to make it more durable than that. Hello. Guys, this is Gabriel. How long have you been flying on the sim? Uh, for like 
this is will be like 15, 20 hours. 20 hours on so the sim, far. but you've never seen it, like never held a drone before? I, I've never like actually piloted it, no. put the goggles on yet. So today's gonna be your first day. Yes. You excited? Oh yes. Are you yeah. nervous? Yes, Don't very nervous. nervous. It's not your drone, if you crash it, we have to fix it. You don't no. even have to fix it. That's awesome, I'm glad you made it. This will be fun. Yeah, thanks. Let's see if I don't break any of the walls. You have to try out everything, that's awesome. Did you crash anything bad yet? I crashed everything so far. Okay, perfect. That's what you should do. Very good. You're doing it right then. There we go. All right. He's in the channel. He's got the Star Wars French run. All right, hard left here, hard left. Boom, boom, baby. Hit the gap. Get the flow. You're in the flow. You're in the flow. Yes. Yes. Right to the wall. <laughs> Stayed in the flow. That was crazy. That was awesome, man. I normally get jitters when there's people watching me and there's like a camera on me, you know what I mean? All right, we're here at Bubbyland and Bubbyland is a little kind of mock office that I created for people to fly the Bubita, which is my little nano drone. Um, we're um, here at Quads and Coffee and we're gonna be letting a bunch of people fly it today. I, I planned out all of the obstacles very strategically. Look at this. So we got like, a little dive right here for all of your, you can do Matty flips, you can do backwards dives. It's a really small gap with the Bubita, it's a really small drone. And so. my goal was to hit every gap to make sure it was possible, so. I have a lot of these little shelves with a lot of holes for people to fly through. You can magic flip this, which we got doing earlier. Power loop the table and the gauntlet of the day. There's a dive behind here. Right there. So that's the gauntlet for people. So far, only me and Mike Duran from GenFan have been able to get it. Little things like this. Gate entry. It's a small gap, but you can hit it. Like I wanted to make the most awesome little freestyle pitch for Bobito. I'm Ian. We're here with the Rotorai guys. We're about to fly one of these little Bobitos. It is probably the tiniest FPV drone I've ever seen. Yeah, I just started flying FPV like two months ago. So we're definitely gonna crash a few times. Let's go. Uh, I do a bunch of stuff with Bobby Sutherland for the Wake Skate League. We did some other stuff with the Space Mob guys this year. So that was a lot of fun. Um, check it out on YouTube. Just search for the Wake Skate League. Oh, nice. Oh, 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 oh. This little guy is crazy. Uh, I film a lot of wakeboarding, so I'm like following people. And I'm pretty good at following people. But FEV is totally different. I just got into it like two months ago. It's, it's um, a totally different game. Like acro mode is not anything like you would ever fly in a DJI drone, except I guess maybe the DJI FPV drone. After flying DJI stuff for like seven years, it feels like I'm just starting over again because I feel like a beginner again. It's, it's been a lot of fun and it's going to be another journey. for putting everything together too. It was amazing. Peace. Peace. Thank you. Sup to Rotor Riot and see ya.